Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so good morning everyone. Morning. Morning. Good morning. morning. So Okay. So it's gonna take us around good morning Alberto. It's gonna take us in general around of one hour and thirty minutes, one hour and twenty up to the traffic conditions to get to the archaeological site of Teotihuacan. So please enjoy the atmosphere of Mexico City. Hopefully we're not gonna have we're not gonna find a lot of traffic on the way. Well so far so good. <laughs> <laughs> this street looks different when it's not full of people. Yeah. <laughs> so, give a couple of hours and then it's going to start to be. Why is the day right here? It's the Saturday. Saturday. Saturday it was shoulder to shoulder along here. Oh, right. <laughs> you got here for the, best, for the best moment, I think. Yeah, well, some of the shoulders I wasn't too sure about. <laughs> Brother from another mother. Brother. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I got a sister from another mister. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> a ver chicos. Bueno guys, enjoy your visit to me in Totihuacan. No, no, no. So, right here they're going to mark us the tickets. Please keep your tickets with you all the time. Almost 3,500 3, years of history. But... <laughs> I couldn't. It's <laughs> fine, still. This, once upon a time, this has been covered on murals. Mm -hmm. So we can get to find the steel on the, on the walls, on the originals to go, the red. Mm. Mm -hmm. A lot of it's been restored then. But actually pretty much all these all yeah. these complex yeah. has been restored to give a good idea yeah. to all the travelers yeah. and to all the tourists that comes here. Um, to, to, to have a good idea how did it look. Especially the group that we're going to visit this is the complex Puma actually making or uh, yeah whistling a sea kite or a seashell. Uh-huh that has three drops falling up from it. Also, it has a headdress, both of them. There's like a C, like a, um, like a CSR in the, in the, on the top of the mural. Can you see it? Yeah. yeah. Okay. That's a representation of the guy who was in the over here we can find something really interesting to me. We can find this one that is a little hands, actually, that are watering the flower. <laughs> Look at it. Look at the difference now from the first picture that we can find on that side. Look at the flowers. Look at the flowers. We're going to find the hands. Also, you can find the original seashells, feather seashells, that are on that wall. And that has still the original colors. Do you have any colors? One for the black water and one for the clean water. <coughs> also, as this was all covered as stucco, for sure, they were canalized against this water through the natural elevation of the landscape. Because over here is higher, and over there it goes lower. So this was all connected. Yeah. So there was a fine mix. They used to compost. That's the expression. And this would carry more the water. Over here, they used to have an incrustation of obsidian on the ice. Probably they have also used jade. We don't know. The most important, or the, the, when they have agreed on this, it was obsidian. So this is. This also represents like the Quetzal bird, which is the representation of the of the feather snake. Because actually, when you see them fighting, the Quetzal is like this high, but the tail, the feathers of the tail can long can length one meter. So when they are fighting, there's something. And then this priest with the headdress, with the with all the fires and all the all the feathers around. They just come with the with the sound of the of the seashells, with the sound of the drums. They will come out 
and present himself to the people. How many people would like runaway would they think would have been here at this time? We're talking about the day. This is actually explaining the calendar of the thirteen. The center. We have the cardinal points, and also at that last structure before we go up on the pyramid, we can that's called we can. So over there, they are talking about also the uh, transversal points of the world. In the Mesoamerican Cosmovision, we're talking about that they, pyramids, actually represents the sacred mountain. The mountain that gives everything. The mountain is going to feed you. The mountain is going to give you the drink. And also represents the three different worlds that they had. From the top of your head up, only the gods can be. That's the upper world. We have the human, or the world, the proper god, the, the proper world, uh -huh, where the human and the gods cohabitate. And we also have the underworld. So, when we die, our souls go now. Over here, all the good, all the evil that you can make, it's going to be here. Doesn't matter if you're good or evil. Down there, we're all the same. So just to have an idea about something else, when the Spaniards <laughs> passed by here, it was all covered. Now, now it's a but how do you look? Hurry up, Cheryl. I know, yeah. These are, these must, I know. They've got, they've got pedals in them, so they're not exactly. As a dynasty, I need to be the strongest yeah. part of it. Yeah. But it's cool that we can still find the original colors. So, over here we are in the most important, well, the most recognized, but not the most important because the whole thing is important. We are in front of the Pyramid of the Sun. 
We're talking about that this is 250 feet side to side and 66 meters high. Mm -hmm. It's supposed that this has been well, This is the one that has been built in only one stage. Huh? We're talking about that this has been built from year zero till year 150. Actual era. So nobody's ever built on top of this. It's here one one temple. Well, the, 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 the one that it's uh, goes yeah. to this one, yeah. it's supposed to be more recent. I'll add it on up, later. Uh -huh, yeah. uh -huh. but, but I'm not up to the things that I have read. Yeah. This is the, the, this has been built in, one, in only one stage. So, why is it This should be built totally yeah. on a cave, yeah. On, 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 yeah, on the top of the cave. Because actually, lots of the buildings, if they are placing or they are in the cosmovision, there is a sacred mountain, and nobody can access until you die to the underworld. This should, there should be a cave there. So this is the tunnel that I was just talking about that goes under. They have sent. Robots, they have sent, I mean, there are a few places that they cannot just go through yet. Uh -huh. They have sent this RC car with a camera on top, so they could they could just start to to look for more. Yeah. But it was like, it's incredible, because you just go reach this chamber, or the first the first place, and then you find another wall. We can find some layer of the stucco just there. We can find the carved Chachiwites on the wall. Mm -hmm. huh? We can find the rattler of the snake there at the bottom. So this is these are the these are the following. <laughs> This is obviously where we just walked. That was the first one. Then come down, this is the big one. This is built in the new position where you just look up. You see it. Do you need water? No. Careful. Yeah.